नमस्ते दिस इज ए क्विक ट्यूटोरियल इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ टू मेक ए वेव एनिमेशन इन सोल वर्क सो क्लिक ऑन द इंसर्ट कंपोनेंट्स क्लिक ऑन न्यू पार्ट सेलेक्ट द पार्ट क्लिक ऑन द वर्क स्पेस क्लिक ऑन द एडिट कंपोनेंट एंड आई एम रियली सॉरी व्हाट्स गोइंग ऑन इन द बैकग्राउंड नॉइस ओके सो प्रेस कंट्रोल प्लस एट फॉर नॉर्मल स्क्रीन टू द व्यू क्लिक ऑन द कॉन रेक्टेंगल ड्रॉ ए रेक्टेंगल एज पर रिक्वायरमेंट हेयर आई एम मेकिंग ए रेक्टेंगल ऑफ एट्टी बाई टेन एम एम ओके but you can change it as per your wavelength requirement and go to features click on extrude and extrude up to 10 mm click okay after that exit the edit assembly component mode now right click on it click on float now click on rebuild after that right click on this part and you can see that we can move it and so select this face and in the assembly click on the right plane click okay Select this face. Click on the top plane. Make sure it's just parallel, not coincide. Click OK. And the last one, but the important one, is select the front plane. Sorry, delete clear selection. Select the front plane, and the front plane of the assembly component. Click OK. Now, close it. Now, what you need to do is press Ctrl and right click on it and drag it. Now, go to the mate. Select this face and this face. Make it mate. Now select this face and this face. Make it mate again. Now select this face. Press Ctrl plus eight for normal skin to the view. Now go to the linear pattern. Click on linear pattern. Select this edge and click on components to pattern. Select this and click on reverse direction. Enter distance of seventy mm. Oh, sorry, two hundred mm. Let's first check me the. I forgot. What's this length? This length is 80 mm. Okay, so we need to make a linear pattern of 80 mm. That is basically 1680 mm. Okay, 80 mm and select the components to be made. Select this face. Click on reverse direction. Click enter 160 and increase the distance to three. Click OK. Now, similarly, go here. Click on linear pattern. Select this edge. Click on reverse direction. One sixty-three and select this. Click OK. Now, here comes the uh, important mate. So, go to the advanced mates. Click on linear coupler mate and select this face and this face. and go downwards click on reverse so basically what it do when this part moves 1 mm upward this part is going to move 1 mm downwards so this is how it works so click okay exit now select this face press control plus 8 for normal skin to the view now i am going to make last part so click on the new part and select the part click on the workspace click on the edit component now select the front plane click on sketch now go to the splines now just click on these points because basically these are going to do our magic charm work and click here press enter press escape now go to features sorry go to surfaces click on extrude surface select this curve and extrude it select the mid plane for a better uh, perspective and extrude it up to a length of let's say 100 mm Uh, it's look good. Yep. Okay, it's look good. Now, now here comes the last part. Press Control plus eight. Uh, now let's do the mo our motion study. So, click on. First, we need to exit the edit assembly component mode. After that, select the motor. Select this face. Click on linear actuator. Click on data points. Click here zero. Uh, make sure that you choose displacement here and enter the value of displacement. For example, I want that it moves uh, 12 mm upwards. Sorry, at zero seconds it is a at a distance of zero mm, but at five seconds it is at a distance of 15 mm, and at 10 seconds it is sorry five seconds, and at 10 seconds it is at a distance of minus. 15 mm now it's done now click okay click okay
now just hide these boxes so by just pressing or just select just select these oh sorry and just select these two parts right click on it click on hide because we don't want to see while doing animation and to remove these local pattern just right click on it and click on hide component similarly goes here click on hide component so because i don't want to see it and go to isometric view and make sure that your orientation is disabled and increase the time bar to sorry i guess i accidentally played so increase the time bar up to 10 seconds and click on calculate here you can see the animation now we need to increase this time bar up to 10 seconds so increase this up to 10 seconds now click on calculate there might be chances when you do this animation this animation might not show up so what you need to do is just simply you need to click on the rebuild icon so that so that you can see that animation so here is our animation part i hope you like this video if you have any doubts and queries make sure that you ask in comments thanks for watching and have a great day namaste